If I know you've been in a situation that blows In such situations, I can give you a script Bit of my fall, wall The devil may come with choices like your life or death In such situations, I want you to choose life by faith Cause if you choose life, you will go for Christ like incense Personal, you find out that he's this very down to her humble being. Scales is actually someone that I don't play with, I don't joke with, like I cherish him so much. I mean, as a matter of fact, he gave me one of my hits and going straight right now. Him as an individual, he's like a great guy, humble guy, down to earth guy, real nigga. Keeps it on, but so we have to give him, we have to give it to him, like. He has paid his dues, he's been through the ups and downs and all that and um, he's still here doing his thing regardless. You know. Many many things with the Yanda girl talk Twitter and Mr. Brown. If not me, I feel don't go commit suicide. You know. <laughs> I'm just kidding though, but man, you guys don't face many many. I don't cast to get down, Yana many many doors. Say you know if you be this, you know if you be that, you can be this and that but he's still he's still here doing his thing and Ah, Skilo. Skilo is a very calm guy. I think everybody knows that one. From his looks, you know that he does not like Wala. But I think he has Wala, so I think he's troublesome. <laughs> I just think so, though. But yeah, so far he's been so calm, he's been so humble, like someone as big as that. And you can see the respect. Small boy like me. <laughs> That's really amazing. I, uh, I think he's a very big fan of my works. I'm a very, very super big fan of his works, too. Yeah, so Skills is a super amazing person. I like it. Skills. I think the first time I met Skills was like 2009. We back that like six years ago, and ever since then it's been, you know, he's a great guy. Though. He's, a, he's a really great guy. Um, he's always keeping his head up. Um, geez, he's just a genius. Amazing person. <laughs> he's very patient and very hardworking. Because that's the only way you can get to this point. Hard work. Um, I remember when I first moved back to Nigeria. Skills were one of, one of the people that helped me, helped me out in the industry and stuff like that. So yeah, I mean, I remember when I was not, people didn't know me. I used to go to interviews, the Skills used to bring me on. Like, yeah, it's my boy Biria, watch out for him. So yeah, biggest shout out to Skills. He's been hustling, so I think he's doing good for us. Watch out for his album, man. It's going to be a classic. I'm proud of him. You know, everybody's waiting, out. Everybody's waiting for the album. So, you know. Skills is a man with nine lives. Um, like every Yoruba knows, we, we actually represent all we, we try to, you know, uh, relate to a person like like, like that as a, as a cat or possibly like in my own language we call it Olubu. He is a man with nine lives. 
If you check out the trail of his story, uh, I didn't want to judge him because I thought he was not hard working because he was on a record label and feeling everybody there is doing great. What was happening to you? But I, I checked out that he worked so hard. You know, you gotta listen to somebody's story. Sometimes you gotta sit with them, understand their mindset, and listen to your own story. And I feel, I feel a lot of guys fail to listen to scales. And but right now, we listen after you actually put up something. Everybody will listen to. And guess what? There come, there come more. And that's what he is now. Everybody knows what scales is about. He's a resilient guy, very strong-hearted. He has a good will. He will die for you. And trust me, people don't even know that about Scales. He's the kind of person who will lay down his heart for you. And that's why everybody this time just saw him as a different person and something's about this guy. An artist who just cannot literally go unnoticed. His success story is very interesting. And um, I'm very, very happy that, you know, even through hard times, he's, he's been able to make it and he's still giving us good music. Been through everything practically mm -hmm. so right now i'm just numb to everything so mm -hmm. when people are insulting me and stuff i just be like oh really and that just makes me want to work harder mm -hmm. you get me and stuff because i mean i'm i've woken up on the internet to see somebody accuse me of posting their news i mean that's crazy what? i've woken up <laughs> on the internet to see on blogs that people are comparing me to 200 naira i've seen that before and i mean but guess what, I just stay quiet and that, as a matter of fact, I just go to the studio mm. and I just want to work harder mm. again, and make everybody shut up. Because mm. at the end of the day, this is my belief, this is my philosophy of life, success is the best revenge. That's true. Like you don't have to go back and forth with anybody, That's it's true. work. That's